Hi, my name's Emma. And I'm Claire. And today we're going to be learning all about spectroscopy and we're going to be doing that in two different ways. Uh, first, we're going to be making this thing called a CD spectroscope. And a wonderful car wheel. A spectroscope is an instrument that we use to investigate white light. And did you know that white light that we see from the sun or we see from our light globes, it's actually made up of lots of different colours that are all combined together to see that white or maybe yellow light that we see. And uh, if you see a raindrop in the sky and the white light has hit that raindrop, it can split that light up into its component colours. So the red moves by a little bit the green moves by a bit more and the blue even further and that's what causes a rainbow. And the same thing happens uh, as if we use a CD, but on the surface of the CD, you can't see it with the naked eye, but there's lots of little grooves in there that we're using as a diffraction grating. So that's gonna split the light up into its component colors. So for the experiment today, what you're going to need, the two CDs, you're gonna need this template here, scissors, and you're going to need some sticky tape and you're going to need some glue. To make your colour wheel, you need a second CD. You will need this template here with some coloured pencils. And to make the CD spin, it's really handy if you've got a marble or a bouncy ball <laughs> and a blob of glue tack. So the first step that you have to do is to cut along these black solid lines here. Then you're going to cut out these two black rectangles and then we're going to fold along these dotted lines here. But there's a really important thing. Do not look at the sun. Okay, now we're going to do the tricky step where we're going to take our CD, we're going to take our cut template and we're going to bring them together to make this CD spectroscope. And it's just important to get the flaps in the right place. So firstly, make sure that you've got your shiny side up. And it's important that this flap on the eye side goes on around the bottom side of the CD, the one with the label on it, whereas this flap on the light cut side of the spectroscope, that actually goes on the shiny side. CD spectroscope, it's finished. The idea is, is we keep the CD as flat as possible to the horizon. Claire, what can you see? There's a rainbow and it's amazing! Now we are going to make the wonderful colour wheel. We'll need eight different colours. This is the colour wheel in action. See how all the different colours combine to make white light. And as it slows down, we see all the different colours again. So astronomers use spectroscopes mounted to very large telescopes to be able to analyse light that has come from space. So this might mean a galaxy that might be millions of parsecs away. We take that light and we split it up into its component colours to be able to see what that galaxy is made of. Astro 3D is the Australian Research Council's Centre of Excellence for all sky astrophysics in three dimensions. Our astronomers are searching to understand the evolution of the matter, light and elements from the Big Bang to the present day. This Astro in the Home series is your opportunity to unlock the secrets of the universe with your own two hands. Find out more by visiting our website, following us on social media, or subscribing to our YouTube channel to be notified whenever we upload new content. Now, go explore the universe. <laughs>